Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well and staying safe of course. So for this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create, create this fox eye, foxy eyes type of makeup look. I have been like waiting just to create this look and I think it's definitely one of my favorite makeup looks. I hope you guys enjoy the video and if you guys have any questions, any comments, please let me know down below. If you guys want to see anything else, also please let me know. Thank you guys so much for subscribing and for watching my videos. I hope you guys enjoyed this one as well. See you guys soon. Bye. I already put my tape at the end of my eye just for a cleaner look. I, I already did my eyebrows. The eyebrows were probably the hardest part of this whole makeup look. So just so you guys know, for my eyebrows, I just like put some glue at the end of my hairs that I didn't want, like just for my eyebrows to be shorter and like higher up. I put um, some eyelash glue on. I'll use my eyelash glue just because it feels like it was a lot easier with the eyelash glue. But whatever is easier for you guys, go ahead and use it. I'm going to be using these three brushes right here. I only use these three brushes. Um, first is the Royal and Lang Nickel Smoke Eye, and it's just like, like a pointed brush, and this is the name of it. I don't know if you guys can see it. This is the name of it. And then the next brush I'm going to be using is the Morphe M321. It's kind of like the same as the one I just showed. It's just like a little bit smaller pointed brush. And finally, we're going to be using the More Freedom Times Jaclyn Hill in JH41, and it's just kind of like a flat brush. I'm going to be using my Modern Renaissance palette by Anastasia. The colors I'm going to be using from here is the is raw sienna and cypress umber. So this one right here, and this one right over here. I'm going to start off with raw sienna. I'm going to go ahead and just just like blend out the product like so. I went ahead and dipped my brush into the shade Cypress Umber right here and just got I just went ahead and blended it out with the other color. <music> I'm gonna go ahead with the Morphe Time Jack Lentail JH41 brush. I'm just gonna take a little bit of black and I'm taking this black from the James Charles palette because the Modern Renaissance does not have a black shade. It's literally just at the tip. Go ahead and blend that as well. I'm going to go ahead and take the tape off. And if you have any mess ups, like I'm still kind of going to be blending um, the shadow out. If you have any mess ups or anything, um, you can use a Q-tip and you can use um, mineral water. I'm going to go ahead with my eyeliner, which is the Wet n Wild Mega Liner in just the color black. I'm going to go ahead and line my waterline and go ahead and make this line right here. Let me show you guys how. And if it's like kind of messy, it's okay. After this, I'm gonna go ahead with um, some black shadow just so it's like, it looks like I have eyeliner, but super blended out. I'm 
gonna go back in with the Morphe Time Jackman Hair JH31 brush, which is the flat brush that I use to add some black. I'm gonna go back into that black and just blend it in a little more. I'm packing it first onto the eyeshadow and onto the eyeliner and slowly blending it out. I'm gonna go back in with my Royal and Inclo Smoky Eye Brush. Now that it is blended out to my liking, I'm gonna go ahead with the Q tip, dip it into my eye makeup remover thing. I have this one by Lancome. This, it is the bifacial double action eye makeup remover. I'm gonna go ahead to the end right there and just guys that is all I did to accomplish this look. That's literally all I did. Just use those three brushes um, cleaned it up black and brown and darker brown and that's it that's literally all i did now that the eye makeup is done i'm gonna go ahead and do my face makeup i'm gonna go ahead and do it on camera just speed things up a little bit go ahead with my wet and wild um foundation i am in the color bronze beige i'm gonna go ahead with my morphe m439 brush buffing brush Go ahead and blend this out. My foundation is on. So now I'm gonna go in with my e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. I'm in the color light beige. I'm gonna go ahead and bake my under eyes with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Loose Powder in the color Banana. Go ahead now and bronze my face up with my Hula by Benefit bronzer. Hey everyone, this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are all being safe and staying home. And yeah guys, I will see you guys soon. Bye!